Hi there. So this is the final video with the tutorial for this semester. A little bit delayed. I'm sorry about that um, because I did some preparations of the exam. But now let's have a look into the two questions about IP version 6. So the first question checks if an IP address is really a correct IP address in the style of IP version 6. And the next question deals with uh, the complete address conversion. So let's directly start with question 1a. So in question 1a we should check um, if the address is correct. So let's have a look here. So what you can do is the first of all you count the number of blocks. You should always have eight blocks. One, two, three, four, five, seven. So you don't have eight blocks. If you don't have eight blocks there must be a sequence of zeros which is rep represented with this double colon mark. And therefore you have to check this though there is no double colon mark. So therefore this address is not correct. Let's have a look into the second one. So um, this is the loopback address. Uh, we have just one of these blocks. So if you have these uh, double columns, then it's only allowed to have one. And you have to start from the most left part here. So in this case, you have 0, 0, 0, 0, and the last number is 1. So this is a correct one. Let's have a look into here. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7. 7. Um, this is a zero. It doesn't matter how many zeros you have. So therefore this is a correct address uh, because you replace the zeros with one. So in this case it's just one block which is replaced but it's correct. Let's have a look into here. So in this case you have two of these um, two colon blocks. So uh, it would be a replacement of zeros in two positions and therefore this is not allowed because it's only allowed to have it once. So, and if we watch this here, then we have a strange thing because if you count one, two, three, four, five, six, it would be that you have two missing blocks of zeros and you have just one column combination. So it's just one replacement. So it seems to be correct. Most of the IP address checkers also accept this, um, but usually you, sh you start with the with this replacement on the most left position. So therefore you should replace this and then you should have zeros here. And it would also be much better to have this because then here you replace three blocks and here just replace two blocks of zeros. So therefore this is not correct. Some checkers will accept this. So maybe you will get it's a correct address. Okay. And then the last one. If you check this, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So 9 blocks, it's not allowed because you just have 8 blocks available. Uh, what you also can check is if they are hexadecimal uh, numbers, so they end in uh, with the last number f. So therefore you can also check this. So from 0 to f, if we have uh, other letters, then it would also not be correct. So. Let's go to question number two. Question number two asks for a complete replacement of the short version of this IP version 6 address and you should uh, replace it with a complete address set. So let's start with A. So in this case it's the loopback address again so what you have, you have always um, you have always eight blocks. Therefore, each of the hexadecimal numbers are are, are uh, one of these um, numbers of these hexadecimal numbers. And therefore, each block has four of these numbers, and therefore you have the situation like this: zero, 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 zero. Then you have this colon: zero, 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 zero. Next block and so on. So in this case I have four blocks and then we have again four blocks where the last number is a one. So in this case it's exactly the same 
um, uh, in uh, binary representation, if you would like to write the binary representation, you have a lot of zeros. Each of these hexadecimal numbers are four binary numbers, and therefore you have, uh, in this case, 16 zeros, colon 16 zeros, and so on, and only last number is a one. Okay? So, let's move this to here, because this is the answer for here, and let's continue with B. So for B, we do exactly the same. So let's have a look at it. So if we do the B, then we'll see the following. So we have a F to C. So therefore we complete it um, with a zero. So we have always four numbers. So F to C is the first one. And then we'll have a sequence of zeros. So now we have to count how many um, blocks of zeros we have. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six blocks of non-zeros. Uh, we have in total eight. So therefore we have two blocks of zeros. And then we have the FF. We fill it up with zeros. We have the two, three zeros and a two. We have the four three zeros and a four. We have the 99, so two zeros, 99. And we have the ABC, which is zero ABC. So we just fill up with zeros um, so that we have the complete IP version six address. So if you would like to convert this now into a binary representation, then you just have to follow the, the, the thing like this so that you say these are four binary numbers, so 4, 8, um, 12, 16, so you have 16 binary numbers and you start with the first block 0, 0, 0, 0, next block is F which is 15, so 15 is this, the next block is a 2, so this is the 2, and the next one is a C, so A is 10, B is 11, C is 12. 12 is 8 plus 4. So this means you have 8 and the 4 and the 0, 0. So in binary, again, you have the 1s here, the 2s, the 4s and the 8. And you just check always each single hexadecimal number is a block of 4 bits in the binary representation. So if you convert the next one, it's quite simple. So you have 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. And then we continue with the next one, this this block here. So again, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Okay. And then we have the 0, 0, FF, which is quite simple. So 0, 0, 0. 0, 0, 0, 0, and then F is 1, 1, 1, 1, because it's 15, 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay, so let's continue. We have the 0, 0, 0, 2, which is this, and the 2 is here. So again, 1, 2, 4, 8, so the 2 is here. And then the next one is the 4. And the 4 is here. And then you have the 99. So the first ones are 0. And then you have the 9. The 9 is 8 plus 1. So you have 8 and the 1. And again, the 8 and the 1. And then you have the ABC. So the first one is 0. The A is 10. 10 is 8 plus 2. So 8 plus 2. And then the next one is a B, it's 11, it's 8 plus 3, so it's or 8 plus 2 plus 1, okay? It's 8 plus 3, it's uh, 11, and C is 12, C we already know from here, so it's uh, 8 plus 4, so 1, 1, 0, 0. So with this you have now the representation in a complete 
real hexadecimal um, writing, which is the correct full form for the IP version 6 address. And if you represent it with the bind representation, it will look like this. Okay, so that's it. Um, we don't have more questions. It's just as I got a lot of feedback that I should send uh, solutions for these questions. So therefore here are the solutions. So we'll see each other in the exam for the students of, of my course. And the rest I, I try to keep on with the videos. Okay. See you next time. Bye bye.